Hey Gemini, welcome to your love reading. This is for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right. <clears throat> All right. Overall energy, eight of wands in reverse. Someone's pulling away or holding back communication, okay? This could be someone you're living at a distance from, could be online communication, okay? But someone keeps on blocking or ignoring communication, okay? They're creating on their own delays. Um, in the past, ace of pentacles in reverse here, so something didn't work out. There could have been a missed opportunity, like a missed golden opportunity, okay? Only because someone was not sure they had their doubts if they could get something off ground. Why do you feel like you're going in circles with this person before even I go through the spread? I feel you guys keep restarting this connection, but it just does not get through that point of, um, um, you know, wanting something stable, something secure, okay? Um, it just doesn't get committed, okay, is what I'm getting. However, someone here is jumping the gun in the current situation with the Ten of Pentacles. So yeah, there is a stable foundation here, an opportunity, safety, security, someone who wants to have babies, you know, and loyalty, merit, commitment, you know. There is an opportunity out here in the current situation, Ten of Pentacles here. Or maybe that's just what your focus is, okay? But in the near future, we have the Three of Pentacles in reverse. This is telling me a lack of cooperation, a lack of compromise, okay? You keep hitting a wall with the person or the situation, okay? You guys are just not going to be on the same page in the near future. Or someone just feels that they're incapable, okay, of making you happy. This is someone who thinks you're out of their league and they think you're too much work, which is why they don't tend to be with you on the same page. What you're doing right now with the page of swords here, you're stalking, spying, okay? You're keeping a watch, you're keeping an eye on this person. Don't, but don't tell me you're not. Don't tell me you're not. If you're not, then you're not re-watching this video. So, yeah, you're keeping a one, an eye on this person, but this is also you just trying to just check out their social media, what they're up to. But I think you're waiting for them to communicate with you, is what I'm getting, okay? Because with the seven of pentacles and your emotions, you've put in a lot of work here, okay? You're waiting patiently, you know, you after putting in a lot of effort into this uh, connection, and you've probably had to wait for a very long time, okay, if, to get the things that you want here. Like, this is like a fucking long-term investment that you're looking at. But uh, you're stopping and taking a stock of the situation, okay, re-evaluating the progress, contemplating if you should continue putting the work on or But you're watching them, okay. What you don't see in your environment coming is the king of pentacles. So, yeah, dealing with someone who's, wa who's wanting to commit to you, but someone very financially stable. They got their shit together, you know, and someone who's wanting long-term. They like traditional relationships. In the outcome here, we have the Ace of Swords in reverse here, which looks to me like there is going to be some kind of, um, you know, um, someone still not communicating the truth, okay? Could be someone who's determined to push you away mentally, but someone's still not communicating the truth or you're still not getting the closure that you want. Could be ten of so Nine of Swords here, a lot of stress, worry, anxiety, panic mode, you know, sleepless nights, you could be them. I feel there's too much confusion here as the outcome here because someone's constantly suppressing communication. And this looks to me like the person you're dealing with because eight of wands in reverse here. Let's see. Two of wands in reverse. See, someone's staying safe. Someone's still not choosing to make a decision, not making that big, bold move. They're not moving towards what they want. They're staying safe because they're fearing change or they're just fearing that they make the wrong decision. What's the eight of wands in reverse? What's the eight of wands in reverse? Why is this the overall energy? Wow. Queen of Wands, Nine of Pentacles in reverse, Four of Wands. Someone wants commitment, 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 commitment. The only thing out here is that things are just not moving as fast as you want them to. Gemini. Someone sees you as the badass here, okay, with the Queen of Wands here. This is someone very attracted to you. All right. They see you as the one. You're, you're, you're just very... Um, in their eyes, you're like... Um, this um someone who is very goal oriented very determined they adore you okay let me just put it out there this is someone who adores you they put you on a pedestal okay they see you as someone very sassy sexy savage confident secure in yourself okay you're the design one here this is you're dealing with someone who's wanting to who was wanting to be single all this while okay that's the kind of person you're dealing with who views you like this okay but they're ready to be in a commitment with you Okay, this person is fed up of either being single or they're no longer wanting to sabotage the connection. Okay, this person was always probably, you know, very abundant. They were all about their money and themselves, you know. But now this time, this person is definitely ready 
to be with you okay they're choosing not to be single and choosing to be with you four of wands this person wants commitment with you they're thinking long term but it the overall energy is it's coming but it's just not going to be at the pace that you want it to gemini a lot of patience needed okay two of swords in reverse here this person is very clear about what they want they made a decision they made a choice okay they're finally no more in denial okay and they're making a choice for themselves and the choice is you baby doll all right why is the ace of pentacles in reverse in the past this is a golden opportunity that was missed. There was an opportunity to have a new start, but someone... Okay. I hate it when there are four cards. I want three cards, but never mind. Eight of Swords in Reverse. Knight of Cups, the Tower, and the Temperance. See? See? That's what I'm saying. It's just... Babe, you're dealing with someone who just is very, very, very slow moving. Very slow moving, okay? Things are just not going to move at the pace that you want them to. This is someone who's very patient, they temper their emotions, they temper their passions, their feelings, you know, they take their time, you know. Someone who's just staying very cool, calm, collected, composed, you know. Uh, someone who likes to wait for the right time, okay. There's too much patience here, too much patience. Someone who has that attitude where, you know, it's like, um, if it's meant to be, it's meant to be, okay. And they're not in a hurry. But there was a there, there was someone who expressed their emotions in the past with the Knight of Cups here, okay. So there is a lot of love here in the past, okay. But with the Tower here, something happened. Okay, and someone released themselves of a situation, I feel. Someone probably got out of their head, expressed their emotions here, okay. But I think there was a tower moment which tells me that something happened. There was an unexpected event, okay, which crumbled the entire situation here. Because I feel you were dealing with someone who was the Knight of Cups here. And you're coming up as a queen. So you're someone who's got that maturity level, okay. You've reached that high level here. You're dealing with someone who's very in and out, in and out, in and out. And probably the universe is like, you know what? I'm going to have to bring in the star of moment. Otherwise, things are never going to change. That's why there was a missed opportunity, okay? But again, things were too slow is also what I'm getting hearing again and again. Someone just doesn't move at a quicker pace or someone just doesn't move at a pace that you want them to, Gemini. Let's just put it that way. Clarify for the Ten of Pentacles. the four of cups and the seven of pentacles in reverse so sweetheart this is a situation that you are done putting in the effort in okay seven of pentacles in reverse is where there was a long-term investment okay something that you had to wait for okay but you lost your patience okay you were not being able to wait for the results okay you feel you wasted your time and energy you gave up on this commitment okay in the past year there was a lot of dissatisfaction i'm getting someone you were dealing with who was constantly breadcrumbing you okay they kept you in a situation okay Kept, give, kept giving you small sort baits to keep you within the situation which caused a lot of stagnation and a lot of boredom okay like well dude are we even getting anywhere you know is this getting somewhere are we getting into a better place you know or are you just going to keep me where we are you know like forever with the emperor here i feel you bossed up i think you're bossing up with the current situation here yeah you're bossing up with an emperor here. You put in your boundaries, okay? You set those healthy boundaries here. You you said no is no. You need structure. You need routine. You want something traditional. And because there was so much dissatisfaction, you gave up on the situation, okay? And now, right now, I think you're very focused on your money, your career, your goals. That's what I'm saying. I, I think you're looking at something very long term but you're looking at commitment here you're looking at something stable okay you're looking at longevity and this person was someone you know who you were very dissatisfied with okay it was like a waste of time and say king of cups there's so much love here there's so much love here i feel the person that you're dealing with is in love with you you know they're probably even coming in to take control of the situation here, okay? Because from the Knight of Cups, this is someone who's growing into the King of Cups. So there is a lot of maturity from what happened in the past, okay? They're growing up. But again, a lot of emotions, but suppressing them. That's what the Emperor does too, right? They think more logically. They keep their emotions on the side. What's the Three of Pentacles in reverse in the near future? Why is the Three of Pentacles in reverse in the near future? Oh 
Knight of Wands in reverse, the Fool in reverse, and Queen of Pentacles in reverse. Yeah, you both don't give a shit to this. That's why there's a lack of cooperation, a lot of lack of compromising. You guys are just refusing to work with each other, you know. You don't get them, they don't get you, is what I'm getting, okay? Now, the biggest problem out here is that, you know, you both are not being able to collaborate because the energies, there's so much of an energetic difference here. One person in the near future is not ready to take this risk here. We have the fool in reverse. Someone's just thinking that this is too much of a risk. They've done this with you a million times, okay? And they're not ready to take, start this brand new beginning or they're not ready to start this all over again, okay, with you or you're not wanting to do this with them again. You're just very focused on your own self, focused on your money, your business, career, goals, etc. Whilst this person here, as usual, in and out, in and out, in and out. And that's one of the biggest reasons here why you don't want to cooperate with them, okay? That's what's happening in the near future here. Um... They're coming in, okay, very reckless move probably, some are very impulsively coming in because that's what the Knight of Wands in reverse also says, right? But you're just like, you know what, no, thank you. Thanks, but no thanks is what I hear you saying, Gemini. You just don't want to work with them. You feel you don't feel appreciated. It's always going to be a one-sided situation, I mean, you know, and you're just like, you know what, I'm good. I'm good on my own and I don't want to waste my time on you. You're a bad investment is what I'm hearing, you know. Not you, but you're, this is what you want to say to this person. Because they're very immature, very unreliable, insincere towards their move towards you. You know, this person, they, they want everything with you is what I'm getting, okay. They want things with you. But the problem here is that their approach towards you is not sincere, okay. They know they can make things happen, but they tend to screw it up, you know. You're dealing with someone who anyways was not sure about commitment, but Knight of Wands in reverse is someone who's absolutely 100% sure that commitment is not the thing for them. Okay, so yeah, they tend to come in because they want you, but then they leave because when things get serious, you know. All right, tell me about the King of Pentacles. This is someone who's coming in your environment that you don't see coming. What's the King of Pentacles? That's the King of Pentacles. King of Cups keeps showing up. Babe, this person loves you, Gemini. I think this person loves you very, very much, okay? This person has a lot of deep feelings for you, okay? A lot of emotions, but they're not sharing that deepness with you, you know? They're not sharing, they're not revealing that. They're a very tolerant person, you know? Very emotionally stable and understanding. They're bottling up their emotions. We have the Two of Wands in reverse, the Justice in reverse, and the Three of Swords here. See, that's what I'm saying. This person is very, very, they're very scared, very afraid, you know. This person ignores making a decision or they keep making a decision that does not, that they don't want, that doesn't inspire them. But they do it because they're afraid of change or because they're afraid of the unknown. So they tend to keep staying in the safer zone. You know, they like to stay in their comfort zone here, which is creating a lot of imbalance here with the justice in reverse. They know they're not making a fair decision. They know it's not fair. But three of swords, you know, this could be some anything. Okay, now this could be either this person who's gone through a breakup in the past, okay, or you've separated from this person, but something's just creating a lot of um, pain within this person. You know, there's a lot of deep seated fears that this person has, and it all has to do with commitment is what I'm getting. It's all going to do with that. It's like one moment they're like, yeah, you know what? I got to do this. I want Gemini. You know, I want, I want to be in a commitment with Gemini. And the next moment they're like, whoa, 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 what am I doing? You know, I need to watch out. You know, like, is this really for me? Do I really want to do this? What if they ruin it? Or, or what if things don't work out? Like they're thinking about every situation of how it can't work out, you know? Just staying safe. They don't tend to make that bold move. You know, they don't tend, tend to uh, get out of their comfort zone and get into that mode of like, yeah, babe, I want to do this. Because look, it's there. Four of Wands here, Nine of Pentacles in reverse. It's there, but Eight of Wands in reverse, it's just too slow or they just don't tend to move. They just don't move. <clears throat> See, King of Cups in reverse, Six of Cups in reverse. Something's left a bad taste in this person's mouth, okay? They're holding a grudge or they're just reliving the past memories that they had. Maybe this person, someone screwed them over, okay? Maybe they had a past, bad past or they just look at the situation or look at you in a very negative way, okay? And that's something you can't do much about. You on the other hand, Seven of Pentacles, I'm not putting in the work, bro. That's what you're saying. Like, no, nope, I did enough. Now, you want me to put anything more? You gotta meet me halfway. Otherwise, I'm not doing it is what I'm getting from you. What's the Ace of Swords in reverse? 
Why is this the likely outcome? Ace of Swords in reverse, please. Why is the Ace of Swords in reverse? I mean, you can take the horse to drink, uh, take the horse to the water, right? But you can't make them drink it, right? And that's what you're doing. You're like, dude, I did all the work. I put in all the effort that I could, right? I put in my 100%. But you gotta at least give me 50, right? And that's something that they're not doing because they're just afraid. They're scared. Ten of pentacles. Ten of wands in reverse. Five of pentacles in reverse. Yeah. You have someone coming in, okay? As the outcome here. There's someone here who's coming out of the cold. For sure. This person is feeling very isolated. They're very codependent on you, okay? They feel left out. You could be giving them the cold shoulder. I feel you're just not talking to them, okay? This person you're dealing with, they have a lot of fear of rejection. They feel you keep rejecting them. They feel you'll get them into this situation. They have, they're have terrified with the, word, with the word love. They know that they want to fall in love. They know they're in love with you. But they're scared because they know once they have love, it can be taken away from them. This person has huge abandonment issues, okay? This person wants to come towards you, okay? Ten of Pentacles, they want this marriage with you. They want commitment with you. They want long-term with you. Families, babies, dogs, hamsters, etc. Because it's too much for them, okay? This is a very overwhelming situation, okay? And, um, but, again, when it comes to communication, they're still going to hold back. They're going to hold back. Ace of Swords in reverse here. There's still a lot of confusion. Either this person needs to clear their head. Okay. I feel fear is clouding their judgment. Because look, it's there. Okay. It's there in their intentions. And it's all they want is four of wands, ten of pentacles. I can't stress enough. You know, they're going to lay the, lay the situation off, okay? Because this is something that's too much of a burden for them. But I feel you're going to have to wait for them because I think right now, this person has a lot of responsibilities, a lot of burdens, okay? And they're doing it all alone. This person is probably exhausted, okay? Or overburdened by something. It's like an uphill battle. But um, I think the moment they've released these burdens, right? They'll come towards you. But as the outcome here for now, there's going to be a delay in communication. I don't see them coming in for right now, but it's, it's there. It's there. You're, you can watch. You're waiting, right? You can wait. That's not a problem here. My problem is what are you doing while waiting for them? You know? Are you constantly like stressing about this? Are you being negative, worried, etc.? No. But I like the way you are with the Seven of Pentacles, Page of Swords. You're watching, yeah? And you're minding your business. I like that. But they're coming in, okay? But I think once they drop the load, okay, of a burdensome situation, okay, what they are burdened with right now, it's too much for them, okay? It's, uh, there is like too much responsibility I'm getting. Either this is too much emotional baggage, okay, whatever. But once they get that load off, that's when they're come, coming towards you. They are. They want to get back to you. They want a reconciliation. They're returning to you, okay? But when it comes to communication, there's going to be a delay here because we have the use of souls and divorce here. This is them negative self-talk or this is them clouding their judgment, okay? But they're coming towards you. It's just going to be some time, all right? So that's what I have for you, gems. I hope this reading resonates with you. If it does, do leave your comments below. Like, share, subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.